Hello YouTube, my name is Anthony. You should know me as Anthony and Airy Wife 5000, which would be in the bottom corner of my own full screen. It's, I think it's that corner, I'm not sure, because my camera is flipped around, so I thought it's mirrored. So I'm going to assume if you go out of full screen that it's in that corner. Besides that, um, as you read by the title, which should be up in that corner, um, this is uh, five things that you can use your rice sock for. Basically, what a rice sock is, is a sock that's full of rice. Pretty straightforward. So, uh, basically, what you do is you can put it in the microwave, um, and it'll heat up, and you could wrap it around your neck like this, and it'll, like, help your neck with the heat, and it's, uh, it holds heat pretty well. But I'm gonna show you five things, including around the neck. Um, on how to use it if you, um, if you want to have more use for it than around your neck. Um, so basically what you can do in the microwave is, uh, you can heat it up. Uh, you should never heat it up more than for two minutes. So basically what you would do is you would put it in the microwave and then set it for one minute. And then once the one minute is up, take it out. And you have to sort of do this just to mix it up so it doesn't like burn the rice and then put it back in um, for another minute if you want the maximum heat or you can divide up the the time so that it's a bit different I usually do 45 minutes not not minutes that would be too much 45 minutes is way too much 45 seconds um, and then I do that and put it in for another 45 uh, which, if my math is correct, it goes to a minute and 30. I'm currently doing this in the basement. I'm not sure if you can tell. I'm currently in the basement. You're currently propped up against the TV that I did the um, Crew 2 uh, Great American Road Trip uh, series on. Uh, I'm going to head upstairs, heat this up for said double 45 seconds. I'm not going to talk because my uh, dad is currently working in the up upstairs, up in the... Uh, second level, his door is open and it's more or less right in front of the front room, which is completely open to the kitchen where the microwave is. So I'm going to go heat this up. I am going to record it, but I'm not going to be talking. So off to there. Okay, I am back. Bit of change in location because my sister got home and she sort of took over the basement. But I've got the rice sock here all heated up. So basically, um, here's the first thing you can do, which is pretty basic. Just have it around your neck. Pretty basic. The next thing you can do is use it as an ear warmer. It's very useful in winter time. Um, just my glasses. Very useful in winter time. It'll it'll warm your ears up. You do sort of look like a dog, but um, it'll warm your ears up. The next way of doing it is if you are laying down. In this case, I'm on the floor, but if you are laying down on your bed, I'm taking my glasses off, you can sort of use it as like a heated. Uh, eye mask to help you sleep. Um, you can also sort of do it sideways if you uh, put it all on one side, stick this under your head and then put this over like that. And then there you go, you have sort of a heated sleeping mask. Next way of doing it is... And welcome back to the basement. Uh, my sister just left, so I'm back down here because it gives me more room to play. I'm currently sitting on a pillow just for adjusting. Uh, the next uh, thing you can use it for, I'll actually have to stand up for, so be right back. Uh, the next thing you can use your rice sock for, on my knees, is if you really want to be like inactive or lazy, just sort of use it as a anchor. Pretty basic. Like, it works for me, like, when I have this on, 
I just feel like standing here. Especially with the heat, it, the heat feels nice on your feet, so um, it will sort of encourage it. But besides this, on to the final way of using it, number five. And for the final way that you can use your rice sock for is a little wrecking ball. Um, currently using Disney buses because that's all that I could find on short notice. But what you can do is you can put it all on one side, preferably the side that doesn't have the opening, and like squish it down like this. Squish it down so that all of the rice goes to the bottom. Lift it up and then Wrecking ball. There you go. Got some Disney buses. But besides that, hang on, let me adjust the camera. Oh, there we go. So that will conclude things. Hang on, I put it away. Things you can use your wrist sock for. F uh, five things that you can use your wrist sock for. Ignore the holes in the pants. Um, yeah, five things you can use your wrist sock for, besides just having it around your neck. Uh, so that will conclude uh, this episode, or well, this video. Um, so yeah, thank you for watching. Check out um, my channel, which would be right here. And then my second channel, which would pop up right here, which is a and NASCAR. I'm falling backwards. And check out Ryan on Racing 4, which is my friend's channel. Ugh. And I'm back. Uh, and then down here should be some random video that I'll decide to put in once I'm uh, editing the video afterwards. So, thank you all for watching. Uh, like and subscribe if you subscribe if you were new. Like if you enjoyed this video. Hit the bell if you want to see more of my videos. Scooch up so that I can hit the pause button. Thank you all for watching, and goodbye.